Good morning, Bishop Lynch. Today is Thursday, February 4th, 2010. I'm Jessica Ashcraft. And I'm Daisy Riker. And you're watching BL yeah. Live. Me? Guitar Hero will be meeting again today after school in McGonagall Theater. See EJ, our lead rocker, or Lane, our head tech, if you're interested. Wednesday, February 3rd, 29 calculus students competed in round two of the Continental Calculus League contest. For this contest, the school score is a sum of the scores of the top six contestants. In first place was Maggie Fitzharris, followed by Zach Bennett, Victoria Ellinger, and Dylan Lewis, who tied for second place, and Sam DeGilia and Barrington Wang, who tied for fifth place. Please congratulate the winners. This message is for all senior ladies. If you are interested in joining a sorority next year in college, please come to an information session on Monday, February 8th or Tuesday, February 9th from 345 to 4 in room 128. The meeting should only last a few minutes. Stop by room 128 if you have any questions. A religious necklace was found in the stadium parking lot after a girls' soccer game last week. If you think it might be yours, please stop by the attendance office. Today, in celebration of Black History Month, we would like to recognize Muhammad Ali, one of the greatest boxing fighters in history. Here are a couple of quotes from Ali. In a statement after, statement after losing his first fight to Ken Norton, March 31, 1973, Ali said, I never thought of losing, but now that it's happened, the only thing is to do it right. That's my obligation to all the people who believe in me. We all have to take defeats in life. And in his book entitled The Greatest, he said, I am America. I am the part you won't recognize. But get used to me. Black, confident, cocky. My name, not yours. My religion, not yours. My goals, my own. Get used to me. We have a lovely way to say Happy Valentine's Day to your sweetheart, best friend, or favorite person. Send the special people in your life Valentine carnations with your own personal message attached. Order carnations for just $1 each at all lunches. The carnations in your message will be delivered during 2B on Thursday, February 11th. Say I love you with flowers from the Junior Student Council. And now for, more, for a couple of announcements from the guidance office. There is a free SAT math prep program taking place at Conrad High School, Fair Oaks Avenue. This is sponsored by University of Texas Arlington, Midwestern State, Texas A&M Commerce, and UTD. The dates, times, and maps are available in the counselor's office on the scholarship wall. We highly recommend that you take advantage of this program. The auction committee needs your help for the class project that will be available the night of the auction. Junior projects, tiles for a tabletop. Juniors, please come to the boardroom Thursday, February 4th after school to work on your tile for the tabletop. Um, freshman project, painting stained glass window pieces. Freshmen, please come to the boardroom Monday, February 8th from 3.45 to 5 and Thursday, February 11th from 12.45 to 2.30. Seniors, don't forget to bring in your typed favorite memory of your days at BL and any photos you would like to include by February 11th and drop it in the box by Ms. Chadbourne's desk for the senior memory box. Information for the sophomore project will be announced next week. Today and tomorrow are the last days for you to take advantage of the early bird yearbook sales. Bring a check or cash to room 120C during all lunches. Cost through this week is $60. You can also buy your yearbook online by going to the BL website and clicking on yearbook link. The price will increase next week, so make sure to get your early bird order for your yearbook in today. See Coach Longoria if you have any questions. The five finalists for the title of Sadie Hawkins King have been chosen, and they are Matthew Boyd, Barrington Wang, Andrew Plugi, Joe Shotland, and Tyler Smith. Vo voting for the one and only King will take place during English classes on Thursday and Friday. Congratulations to these fine young men, and good luck. The following students have detention scheduled for Thursday, February 4th. Reese Olavi and Bourne. Caleb Cooper, Case Garrison, Andrew Gutierrez, Kat Hennessy, Riley Hender Herndon, Zach Coyle, Jordan Hunt, Tyler James, Mackenzie Keane, Kelsey Koval, Sam Llewellyn, 
Liz Merkel, Mary Merkel, Lindsay Montgomery, Stephen Nix, Lexi Nolan, Eric Palfi, Colin Porter, Victoria Soto, Terry Stecker, George Taylor, Ben Tompkins, and Nikki Vance. Detention begins promptly at 3.45 p.m. in room 601 of St. Dom's. Please be on time and in complete uniform. If you are late, you will be required to serve a Saturday detention also. The following students have Saturday detention scheduled for Saturday, February 6th. Hunter Ivy, Anna Padilla, and Jamie Selman. The following students have Saturday school scheduled for Saturday, February 6th. Jimena Alvarez, Amber Meza, Jake Raymond, Kelly Swanson. Saturday detention is from 8 a.m. to 10.30 a.m. Saturday school is from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. Please meet in room 302 of the VPA in complete school uniform. No casual Friday attire is allowed. Bring your school books with you, and if you are serving a Saturday school, bring a lunch and a drink also. Today's lunch is chicken rings. And now for the joke of the day. Daisy, why is a shellfish stronger than a shark? I don't know. Why is a shellfish stronger than a shark? Because it is all muscle. <laughs> <laughs> if you have an announcement for Be Alive, please send it to BeAlive at bishoplynch.org. Put, please put only the date of the announcement in the subject line. Announcements will run for two consecutive days. Bye. <laughs>